Hi, Janice Winward here with Midnight Arts. Tonight I am going to try to do a Dutch pour. Um, I'm going to try to do it over these three canvases and I don't know what makes me think I could possibly do it because I've tried the Dutch pour before and I've always failed. Um, <clears throat> but I did mix up my paints today very thin and, I, and the mixture has um, paint <coughs> And just a little bit of Floetrol, like two parts of paint, one part Floetrol, and, and then it's thinned with water. And I know uh, uh, Rinska Donnie, uh, I'm probably saying her name wrong, um, this type of pour has been around for a long time, but she made it famous just recently, and that's why it's called the Dutch pour. And I know when she was first starting to do it, she just thinned her paint with water. That's all she put in it. And, and they say the paint needs to be pretty thin. So I have mixed up some, some paints that are, that are thinned with water. I did, they have no glue, no silicone, no pouring medium, anything like that, a little bit of Floetrol, and then thinned with water. So uh, maybe it'll come out a little bit better this time than what it has the last uh, times. So um, I am using um, Best Look Tea Rose and best look stone haze and I don't didn't have uh, my squeeze bottles to put them in and they're way thinner than I usually have them so uh, I wanted them in kind of a different bottle anyway and then I'm also going to be using uh, Masters Touch Titanium White it has a, it's a uh, salad dressing bottle and it and I put the little thing in with the hole in there and it's kind of doing a weird thing coming out kind of weird okay oh, can't get the lid back on that one. Oh, that must not be very level that is really odd because I usually don't have trouble with running off one side normally Okay, so I am putting my hair dryer on cool and then I am going to put it on probably high. Okay, I have to do that again because I scooped it with my hair dryer <laughs> right there. So I'm going to put some more paint on there. Oh, that doesn't, I didn't put the lid on the white. <laughs> okay, hopefully I won't scoop it this time. Oh, I should put some That won't work. Okay. Well, I can't say that worked. I really wanted it to go a lot further up this way. I just really don't like that part right there. <laughs> I really don't like it. <laughs> oh, oh, that was way too much, way more than what I wanted. <laughs> It's 
a little bit better. Now what do I do with the other side? This one out of the way. Oh dear. <laughs> that is so much paint. I'm really going to have to get another canvas or something and dip it in that. Okay, I'm going to work with it this other direction. really a pain when I dip my <laughs> scoop my hair dryer in it <laughs> well I would like to get this to come up a little bit further but I don't know I don't know what to do Well, I guess I'm just not going to get that part of that canvas covered, which, I mean, this is the top and this is the bottom parts that they'll hang, you know. I'm thinking this is okay. I'm kind of like, oh, that's not very good right there. This doesn't look very connected right there. It looks like different pores. See, I scraped it again there. <laughs> uh, okay. Um. <laughs> I think that's. I think that's. That's it for this one. <laughs> Okay, I think that is uh, enough for this one. I don't know how to lift it up to show you. There's a lot of paint on there. There's that one. That will be the bottom. Oh, i got to fix that. Okay, that will be the bottom one. This is the middle one. Gotta do something with that. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't look quite so much like a drip. <laughs> okay, so that's the middle one. This is the top one. Oh, let's see, can't see. Oh, there's kind of a good one there. Okay, thank you so much for uh, joining me. Please come back and join me again soon. Please subscribe, like, and share. And most importantly, please have a great night. Okay, here's this triptych. Um, I tried to do the uh, Dutch pour on it. <laughs> Not very successfully. Okay.
and I had so much paint on the table afterwards that I dipped two canvases there's two four by four tile I can't see them very good uh, and a six by six tile and another six by six tile and some magnets and um, I had lots of paint left on the table that I scooped up and put into a cup and then in the next the next paintings I did I used it for the base for those paintings and still had some left over so uh, anyway that, that that particular painting ended up using lots of paint okay thank you for watching and please have a great night